looking for a ride Is there a chance that we could make another try? I think we meant to be, didn't wanna say goodbye If there's a chance, just tell me how Time is precious, time is now Don't wanna take it slow Hey family, welcome back to my channel or welcome if you are new here. Thank you so much for stopping by today. We're just going to get straight into it. You saw the before, how it started. We've already cleaned and now it's time to decorate. So yes, I'm using a lot of things from last year, but some things new this year as well, like this footed pedestal or this footed tray. Um, I love it. I got it from Hobby Lobby this year. It was 40% off, but I like the black feet on it with the natural wood wood tone so here I'm just putting these German status dried florals in this Walmart vase um, y'all might remember a few months ago it was viral but look at how these stems are shedding y'all I'm like oh my goodness look at how they just dropped everywhere which can be expected sometimes with dried florals but I wasn't expecting this much to fall apart so I will definitely not be moving this piece for the entire fall season I mean even down on the floor y'all it just was like <laughs> going everywhere so we're going to quickly vacuum that up and while i'm getting that taken care of i just want to go back real quick um the wall art that i put on the mantle i got that from hobby lobby last year i just love the colors of the pumpkins and then the purple eucalyptus that i put in that target vase i got that this year um online order from kirkland's it was a set of four if you watched my kitchen decorate with me video you saw that whole bundle and i also have that's one of those in the kitchen so i thought it would play well you'll see it when we pan around so here i'm just putting my minka pot or my minka vase i got from anthropology but look at this little pumpkin is it not the cutest i got this from the dollar store y'all look the detail in the leaf and then it actually opens up and it's ceramic and i love it so i was just trying to go for a little dark light contrast with these colors i wanted to show you this wall art that i put up well fred put up a couple of months ago so I got it from Kirkland's and blue is my favorite color but I really want to pull blue out when I'm decorating for fall this year so I'm starting with this blue glass pumpkin I got this from Kirkland's as well I want to say it may have been 40 or 50 percent off when I purchased it but how cute is it and it just fits so perfectly all right so I have benches um, on either side or on both sides of my fireplace you see it right here and I already have some throw pillows on there but I want to add like one more on each side just for the fall theme so I got these pillow covers maybe two years ago might have been last year I don't remember y'all but they came from Amazon they're 18 by 18 pillow covers so I'm using like a 20 by 20 insert just to give me that fullness that I'm looking for in the pillows but also want to make sure they're still choppable because I'm a chop my pillow girl I don't know if you are but that's what I like to do and one tip is just to make sure that you get those corners in really good when you're putting your insert into the pillow because that will also give the pillow a more full look. So that's what I'm doing right now is just making sure I get those corners in and I like to zip it up where the tag from the insert is at the bottom that's just a preference i have i don't like the tags to be at the top but all right easy peasy lemon squeezy let's fluff it on out we'll flatten it on out and then we're going to do that chop and then i'm going to take you over back to the benches and we're going to place them on the bench before I placed them on the bench, y'all, I looked at these pillows and I was like, oh, I haven't fluffed them in a while. So I'm going to do that. But I also wanted to rearrange the order that they were in. So I'm not really removing any of these pillows. I'm just switching up the order. And to me, that just gave it an even more profound look. Like this pillow right here, I decided to take that middle stripe and make it go 
horizontal where previously I had it vertical and now I'm just going to go ahead and add this throw blanket these were in my entryway on the chairs so if you haven't seen that fall entryway video I'll link that for you I think I had them on there yeah but I'll link the video anyway so I'm just folding this blanket right here and then I'm going to add on the pumpkin pillow on top of the blanket and I just really love how it all came together so there's my pimp pump, pump, there's my pumpkin pillow and we're just gonna chop it like I love to do and I just love the arrangement and I did the same thing on the left side so now I'm gonna go work on the front of the fireplace these lanterns I got last year from Kirkland's and I'm just gonna insert some of those you know LED lights or LED candles they're battery operated you can get them from pretty much anywhere now these two vases were originally here but I had moved them to the other side of the bench and I'm gonna put them back but look at these florals that El Boogie and I found at Hobby Lobby now the stem was too long and on this day my hands weren't doing what I wanted them to do to bend the stem together so I just found a rubber band and I'm just tying it together so that it will fit into the vase easy peasy lemon squeeze Easy and it'll be easily removable now with this stem okay y'all ready look at this pumpkin stem oh my goodness and I love the white color so I'm going to add this stem just right sort of kind of in front of the stem that's already in there and I love the effect that it gives like the leaf stem is like a breakup of the color and then the pumpkins in front just really pop more so now I'm just going to rearrange the lanterns with the vases so I'm going to pair the tall vase with the tall lantern and then do the smaller vase with the smaller lantern and I just love how it comes out let me know in the comments how you like it because it, it's just giving everything it's supposed to give for me <laughs> y'all i really wish that you could feel how soft this throw blanket is oh my goodness and look at the little um pom poms like what <laughs> So this is one of my favorite throw blankets in my house. I got this a couple years ago from a store called The Christmas Shop, which has since gone out of business. That was a real bummer for me. But I'm going to add this blanket over here. And you've already seen this in some of the intros in my videos already. But here's where I'm styling it. And I'm adding this pumpkin pillow. I got this last year from Hobby Lobby. But they also have it this year in this cream color, but also in like a gray silver silverish color I have both of them the gray one is going to go in another room so here again blue is my favorite color I picked that vase up from Ross earlier this year and I have a third stem like the two I used in front of the fireplace so I'm just adding that right over here by this gray bench which is also a storage bench y'all I got this from TJ Maxx last year score score all right moving along to the sectional just going to fluff out these pillows I'm not changing the pillows that I already had but then I'm going to add these really cute pumpkin pillows they are Sherpa material and soft is an understatement I got it from Kirkland's it was like 50% off when I purchased it and I just love the look of it still kind of keeping with the neutral but also making it more fallish so here again still keeping the pillows that I already have just going to fluff them out um, these are actually inserts and the pillow covers I got from Amazon I think last year sometime but moving right along got those fluffed out and then guess what I forgot y'all <laughs> I forgot that I wanted to put a throw blanket under these pillows so here I am just moving them back out the way and I'm just gonna lay this throw blanket across this blanket is smooth like butter okay <laughs> I got this from Amazon and I love the chocolate color of it. I think it just really springs or screams 
fall vibes so I'm just really playing with how I want to lay it up under these pillows but at some point I'm just gonna be like you know Anitra it's a throw blanket girl just throw it on there and let it fall where it may and then I'm gonna go ahead and put those two pillows back on and then add a third lumbar pillow just for some layering effect and also different heights so this third pillow that I'm adding oh my goodness it is so cute let's get cozy I love it I got it from Kirkland's as well and the plaid part y'all is like a velvet material all right here's the reveal of the room I absolutely love how everything turned out. I love the pops of blue and the color in the wall art, but also keeping like a neutral foundation and that I used a lot of things that I already had so I didn't have to add too much to the space to give it that fall vibe that I'm going for. I really hope that you have enjoyed this video. Thank you so much for being here. Please remember to like the video, subscribe to the channel if you like the vibe, and I will see you in the next one. Bye!